Hello children, welcome back. We are doing chapter time and motion. And as I have told you in the previous video, today we are going to discuss numericals based on speed. Speed as we have already defined is distance travelled by an object in unit time. So, the formula for speed will be speed is equal to distance divided by time. Now, let us read the first numerical. A toy car took 20 seconds to cover a distance of 10 meters. Find its speed. I have already written the uh, formula. Speed is equal to distance upon time. Now how much is the distance here? Distance is 10 meter. And time taken is how much? 20 seconds. So let us divide. This is half meter per second. Or you can write it as 0 0.5 meter per second. After dividing 1 by 2, we will get 0 0.5 meter per second. So what is the speed of the toy car? It is 0 0.5 meter per second. I can say that in 1 second, the toy car is traveling 0 0.5 meters. Understood? Now, come to the second one. A school bus covers 1500 meter in 100 seconds. Find its speed. Means in 100 seconds, the school bus covers 1500 meter. It travels 1500 meter in 100 seconds. So again, let us write down the formula. Speed is equal to distance upon time. Distance is how much? I will write here. You will find it easier to understand. 1500 meter and divided by time that is 100 second. 0, 0 we can cancel out. So we get 15 meter per second. So the school bus covers 15 meter in 1 second. In 1 second it will travel how much? 15 meters. So the speed of the school bus is 15 meter per second. I hope you have understood this. Let us go to the next in which we are going to study how we can calculate speed in kilometer per hour. So our next numerical is a train travels 450 kilometer in 3 hours. Find its speed. Children normally vehicles like car, train, they take, they travel large distances and take more time. So we have to express the speed in kilometer per hour. This is one of the examples based on that. So here again we will write the same speed is equal to distance upon time. Distance is 450 kilometer upon time is how much? 3 hours. So 450 divided by 3 we will do. 450 divided by 3. 3 ones are is 3 minus 1. 3 fives are is 15. 0 is remaining. So put one 0 here. So you get how much? 150 kilometer per hour. That means you can say that the train is traveling at a speed of 150 kilometer per hour. It is covering 150 kilometers in one hour. So children, I hope this session will find you very acquaint or uh, E easy to understand the numericals based on the speed. In the next one we will see how we can convert kilometer per hour into meter per second and meter per second into kilometer per hour. Okay. 
Till then, have a nice time. Thank you.